Welcome to Divination Queen and today I've got Francesca with me. She's going to help me perform the trick. Say hello Fran. Hello. Okay, I'm going to introduce you to the props. I've got a little red velvet bag in here, inside this red velvet bag I've got a brass casket. Inside this brass casket I've got a real silver Kennedy half dollar. I'm going to prove to you it's silver now because I've got a big magnet here and stuck to this magnet is a, a British 10 pence piece and it's magnetic. Just take that off there and I'm just going to show you that the silver coin is not magnetic. Neither are these brass casket and lid. Okay? And there's nothing magnetic inside the bag. The bag's completely empty. Can't really turn it inside out, but I'm going to show you. Would you like to inspect everything? Yeah. Looks good. Okay. Right, what I want you to do in a minute, I want you to take this coin and I want you to place it inside the casket, heads or tails facing up and put the lid on. But I'm going to turn me back. I also I want you to shield it as well. So the viewers can't see it and it'll be a surprise for them as well. Okay. I'm going to turn me back. And tell me when you're done. Okay. Okay. Right. In a minute, I'm going to ask you to take this casket, put it inside your hand, like so, and I'm going to try and guess which hand it's in. All right? Okay. So I'm going to turn me back and place it back down again. Okay. Okay. Can I turn back round? Yeah? Yeah. Right. I want you to th think about which hand it's in. I want to try and pick up on your thoughts and, and a bit of body language as well. Now you're thinking really hard, ain't you? Yeah. Okay. I'll say it's in this hand. Yeah. And that also tells me that the coin is edge side up. Yeah. Let's have a look. Do you want to show more? Do you want to show everybody on the camera? And can you see that? Edge side up. Okay. Let's try another little experiment. I'm going to take the coin out again and I want you to do something slightly different. But first I want you to put the coin in again, either way facing up, and I'll turn me back. Okay. Okay, and then place the casket back in the centre of the table. Okay. Turning me back now. You're shielding it from the viewers as well, yeah. so it's a surprise, yeah. Okay. Now, we're both going to put our fingertips on this casket and I'm going to try and pick up, see if I can pick up some cups, some kind of vibration okay. in your body language as well. Yeah. So just place your finger on the casket. Okay. And you're thinking about it, I want you to picture yeah. it, you're thinking about the coin, yeah? And which way it's facing up. So much telling me you've gone for the same way again, Ed. Yeah. You have? Yeah. Let's have a look. Can you show everybody on camera? It's Ed's facing up. Okay. Well, I want you to do it again, but this time I want you to put the coin in, either way facing up. Okay. Put it inside the casket and then put it inside this red velvet bag and I'm going to turn me back. I want you to cover it all so it's a surprise for the viewers as well. Okay. I'm turning around now and I can't see and I want you to cover it with your hands so nobody can't see. Put it inside the bag. Are you done? Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Now, can you just pass me those two other props over, please? Now, can you explain to the, the viewers what this board is? It's a divination board and it's used for predicting the future and asking questions. And what's one of these? It's a pendulum. And what does that do? 
it swings um, either way and it'll tell you your answer. It'll, it'll answer, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to take this coin and I'm going to place it onto the, the board like so. I don't know if the viewers can see, let's just place them back there. I don't know if the viewers can see, but we've got heads here and tails there. So basically if it swings that way it's heads, for, forwards and backwards, and if it goes left and right it's tails, okay? So I'm going to use this pendulum over the top of the coin, like so. I'm going to try and keep it as steady as possible and I want to see if it can answer the question whether it's heads or tails. It's just trying to keep it steady. Now it's swinging left to right. That's telling me it's tails, it's got to be tails. So you've gone the opposite way this time. Yeah. Is it correct? Indeed it is. It's tails, that's yep. unbelievable. Can you just take it outside the bag, the casket, open it up and show all the viewers that it's tails side up. You take the coin out. Okay. I hope you enjoyed that and thank you very much for watching. Say bye Fran. Goodbye. Bye. Is that ending a bit naff the boy? Is it? Say bye Fran. Bye. Is it, is it